How tall is he? And welcome back. Welcome back, guys. He's a tall motherfucker. To... He how is... high is the arena and how tall is he? The walls of the arena are about 20 feet high. Okay. There's well. kind of a um, protective magical dome around it so you can't injure the, um, okay. the crowd. Or n nor can the crowd like do anything to get into the arena. Um, Thok himself is... Uh, six foot eight or so. He's a half orc. He's a half orc monk. Okay. Big old boy. Um, that's all I need to know. Yeah. So the arena announcer, of course, comes on. Uh, Crack it up. <laughs> welcome to the arena. We have, fresh after the Summer Festival, a new challenger has come against the champion, Thok. Yay! Hey. What's that name? What was his full name? The Imp Thok Spasher. Thok the Skull Crusher. Skull Crusher. <laughs> yeah. Nagri. Um, what was... Did you have... Oh, just, just Nagri. What's, what's your last name? Do you have a last name, Nagri? No. Make okay. one up. The Nagri. The Nagri. <laughs> <laughs> He's a warlock, so we'll kind of see how this goes. I'm interested to see. I don't think it's going to go well for old Nagri. <laughs> but uh, you never know. I just thought you just crit right off the bat. It's just fucking back up. You win. never know. You never know. Anyway, who will win? Let's find out. Fuck. Lower the gates. Give me an, an initiative roll, please. Better go first. Nope. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> uh, what is it? Three. Okay, so Thok's going first. <laughs> you both kind of step into the arena. Uh -huh. <laughs> Here it is. Boom! Boom! <laughs> All right. Let's see. <laughs> All right. You know, so, like an arc when the biz move thought chick to screen. That's why because thought's going first. Uh, yeah. Move thought mm -hmm. just all the way forward. It's right, right, right there. Mm -hmm. that, 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 that's good. Okay. So thought's <laughs> going to run in. Oh no! And he's going. And this is he is not really wearing any armor. He's he looks like that little figure does. He pretty much just wears like a almost a loincloth kind of a thing. Uh, all super jacked, probably distracting to Nagri. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so. I love Nagri's in the Maybe just a little bit. Of it. <laughs> and, uh, He's ripped. All hair. <laughs> <laughs> He's going, because he, he gets two attacks. I'm going to stop you after the first attack. I'm going to use my reaction. Uh huh. Ooh. And use Misty Escape. Okay. So I'm going to disappear. Does that automatically miss? Yeah. Okay. So where are you going? I'm going to go right here. All right. Ooh! That's where everybody went. Ooh! Oh, like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Second attack, nine, ten. Yeah, that's she, fine. She went farther away. <laughs> hey, you got away from one. And he's gonna do flurry blows. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> this gives him an extra eighty-five attacks. <laughs> two. Yeah. Actually, that'd give him an extra two attacks, so that gives him three total attacks here. Okay. What's your AC? Sixteen. Okay. So you're gonna get hit. Twice right. of the three. Okay, how much damage? How much is your HP? I'm getting that set up here. Bear with something. me. Yeah, seventy-two. He may die in one hit. No. Nah. How much does damage? Well, he's just hitting. Is, is, he does as much damage as you do. He, no, he's he's unarmed right now. He's just hitting. But that's what he was with. Uh, <laughs> twenty-one damage. Okay. That's not bad. Yeah, you get like four turns. <laughs> okay. Twenty-one damage as he um, is is just un, un, unleashing punches 
to your kind of midsection, um, kind of getting a feel for where your weak spots are. Okay. And uh, squishy. Kind of the kind of the test. Oh, right. keep hitting me! All right. Oh. So <laughs> it's your turn okay. now. That actually might be a good strategy. If you start to like it, he might not enjoy it. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Yeah. Do it. I mean, he's super ripped, though. <laughs> Just get one of those. Get one of those random like wrestling boners. All right. Go ahead. It's your turn. So, yeah. So I'm gonna reach forward and rub his abs, and as I do, I'm gonna use the bonus action from my studded leather of phasing. And mm -hmm. phase 20 feet away. 20. Okay. And then for my action, at his point, I'm going to cast Hunger of Hadar. So, 20 here. So it's like a 20 foot radius? It's 20, yeah, 20 feet from around. Okay, I got it. We're so, good. Yeah. Just. So pretty much this whole everything over here is covered in like dark tentacle. Yeah, he stuff. can't he can't see in and like I can't see him, but he can't see where I am. Okay. So he doesn't know where I am first of all. So he he doesn't know how to get he does your sense of direction in there is confused, so you can't mm. just run straight out. Right, right. If you start or end your turn in there, you take damage. Got it. How much damage? Any creature that starts its turn takes 2d6 cold damage. Okay. Any creature that ends its turn must succeed on a dexterity saving throw or take 2d6 acid damage. Got it. Nice. Sweet. I'm actually going to cast it as a 5th level spell though. Uh-huh. So. It'll do more? It'll do 3 instead of 1. 3 dice instead of 1. Okay. I'm going to do 2d6. Let's do six. Well, no, so it'll do five instead of one then, because you add a level for every dice. Three, right, right, four, right. Five. Got it. Well, oh, no, it'll be four. Okay. And then. Nice. Okay. I'm going to step here. Okay. Actually, here. No, here. Okay. Got it. All right. Now nice. remember, he's confused running around there too when he goes I got to it. go. Out. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna randomize his running direction. All right. So, so he uh, starts his turn, so... That's 5d6? Yeah, five, no, 4d6 cold damage. 4d6, got it. Okay. Yeah. Roll so, them there, there's... There's, there's, one there's, right there's here. Oh, he's got the whole thing. Yeah. Yeah. There's a shit ton of dice over here. Get it, Nagri. Get make, me, make me break even on the bets. Let's see what happens. Five, six, seven, 13. Yeah. Is... And that's not like a saving throw or anything, right? The start just, one's not. The first one's not. The end is. The, if you the end your turn, it's a dexterity saving throw. Got it. Okay, so how much is it? 13. 13. 13. 200 nice. HP. That's, that's so like 100 something, but. He had about as much as you did. Yeah. And, uh, alright, so. 135? About. We're going to use. 10%. Yeah. 10% is health. An 8 Dark Souls, you think? Oh, thank God, I hit that because guy. Because there's mm -hmm. 8 different directions that he can move in. Okay. So this is uh, one, and it's going to go okay. around. Like one, two, three, four, okay. five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so Let's put one there. That's a two. And he's going this way. So he's going this way. Okay, got it. So one, two, three, and he'll kind of hit or yeah. like he'll reach hit a wall. Reach the wall, right? So that's three, and then he's going to go around the wall. Um, four, five, and now he can see. Um, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh! <laughs> that was almost good. All right, here we go. <laughs> Without all of his movement, though. Yes, that's all of his movement. Okay. So now, first attack. As he goes to attack, I'm a bonus action misty step. Away. How many times can you miss a step? Actually, oh, and actually, I'm going to bonus action and use hellish rebuke. Huh? It just does fire damage. Well, to right, me. right, but like. All um, right. I have to hit first. Okay, well, with, hit with me. Um, but how many times can you miss a step? Once per day? Yeah. Okay. Uh, that's a hit. Okay, no, it's once per long rest. But... Yeah, right, right, right. Once per long rest. Okay. That's fair. Hit. All right, so that's a hit. 
So roll your hellish hellish rebuke damage okay, for me. You have succeeded dexterity saving throw. That's two d ten fire damage. One one cast just a high level spell, obviously. Uh, Can you cast it higher level? Yeah. You cast cool. up the fifth level, so. Nice. All right. Well, I didn't know that. So dexterity saving throw. Should right here. At higher levels. Fair enough. All right. Roll it. So, are you casting it at like a fifth level spell? Yeah. All right. So, what is that? Five d eight. Yeah. D tens. Five d tens. All right. I got. I got. I got that in spades here, guys. See, this is the first level. So you're doing level yeah. fifth level spell. Yeah. So you would actually get six d tens. Okay. Very <laughs> nice. Very yeah, nice. It's, it's dope. <laughs> oh shit! It's all wet right there. Might be my bad. It's dope as hell. Damn. Wait, wasn't there a saving throw though? Dexterity, yeah. Oh yeah, I do a dexterity if you half damage if he passes. Yeah. What's the DC? Sixteen. Yes. He Actually, uh, let me check and see what the mod. I want to say that there's a dexterity. Yeah. So yes, he will. Right. He will so, pass. So it's gonna be half. Okay. Fucking shit. 10, 20, 30, 39, 48, 41, 48, so 24. That's, that's tasty over here. That is tasty. <laughs> Damn. All right, all right, Dagger. Very nice. Okay, so that was the first hit. Check out this. This is the second hit. How much did the first hit do to me? I haven't okay. rolled it yet. Okay, <laughs> no, so, so no, the second watch one's going to hit. Down. He's going to use Flurry of Blows, spin, spin an... an Another key point. It's the adjustment that moves up. Actually, he's going to spend <laughs> two key points and oh, do God. a, a stunning do strike. Stunning strike flurry of blows. Okay. Oh, oh there goes an aggro. Yeah. All right. So both of the flurry of blows will hit two. I need you to give me a constitution saving throw, please. Nice. How much damage did you do? Mm, 18. 18. Not bad. Ooh. Nice, okay. So you are not stunned. That's always good, but you are going to get hit. He's going to be stunned. He's going to be unconscious. I'm going to be dead. <clears throat> You'll be dead. Yeah, but... I'm going to steal your charge and juice of all my things. They did. Uh, so with, with all four hits, and yeah. he's, he's, he's doing kicks and punches and everything, just like... Three blows. Uh, Thirty-eight damage. Let's do it. He's still in there. I need you to make um, the saving throws to maintain concentration. All on the spell. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Okay. Well, and that's once per hit. You can just go ahead and break the spell if you want. No, dude, roll for no, it. No, like, yeah, you okay. Can. Well, there's the first hit. Twelve. All right. Pretty sure you just have to hit. Um, ten. Hit ten, yeah. So that's good. That's good. Okay. Oh. Nope. So, okay. It's well, kinda, it's broken. That's it's gonna kind of fizzle. I, I'll have to verify that. No, it's the concentration spell. So. Yeah. Well, I mean, like as far as what you would have to roll, but with the two. Oh. I'm even, even even with the. Uh, I think it's a ten. Constitution. Yeah. Uh, modifier. So that that spell's gonna kind of fizzle. So if it's like oh no, this, it's gone. I don't know what to do, guys. <laughs> what am I gonna do? All okay. right, it is your turn. <clears throat> the biggest and most meanest spell you have. Probably. I can do that, or I could just throw another Cthulhu <laughs> field out. You have blight. Yeah, I have blight. Well, that does pretty pretty tasty damage. You're gonna have to. Uh, well, moving's not really an option. Yeah. Right so. Flying. But he'd probably grab you. I can't fly high enough because there's 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 a fucking ceiling. I mean, how high? Kind of ruined my there's, strategy. I wanted to just fight him. Like I'm gonna fly up here. You can't reach me. The magic dome is like probably at its at its apex is about 35, 40 feet up. That's pretty high. Oh, so I could get 40 feet in the air if I use fly? Mm hmm You will give him an attack opportunity by leaving him, so he may grab you. Yeah, he'll fuck you up. You act like I can't teleport away. 
teleport him through a wall. Oh, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Into a wall. But that would affect both of you. Not if we do like, <laughs> yeah. bam. Yeah, yeah right. They hold him through the wall. I'm like, well, the whole point of me fighting him though is so he would join us. So. Is you want to kill him? He can't do that <laughs> if he's in a wall. Well, he would be expelled from it and take bludgeoning damage usually. Get it. Get Tell it. Tell more arena and disqualify him. Boom. Does it work that way? For, uh, I mean, it I mean on the only there. teleport, so I can only do Dimension Door, but I don't know if that would work on him. <laughs> you push him the door and close it. Nah. <laughs> dimension him out, out of the arena. Can I, can I attempt to do <laughs> like, that? Can I do that? Uh, okay. <laughs> I mean, would that count as besting him, though? No. No? Okay. Well... Sorry, I just wanted to change up the music. Can he jump really high? And, does he have any ranged attacks? Uh, Probably not at, at present. No, he's unarmed. But monks are pretty. Uh, they're very dexterous. He could probably jump up and hit Don't me. Don't you have the thing that can push him backwards? Yeah, yeah. but. If you do that, then you you gotta get damage on me. He's, sure. he's gonna kill you next turn. You gotta go big or go home. Go big or go home. Go big or go home. But if he can hit me while I'm flying up there, though, what's that matter? Well, because it, it'll be harder to hit you while you get there. Alright, so right, it's either he so, hits you automatically in your next turn and you die, or you chance it by flying up in the air and you die. I'm <laughs> going to use my wings of flying. They're not going for dying. No, wait, knock him back first, because if you use that, you're going to get a prevent attack of opportunity. I can teleport away and then fly and then move. Okay, that's a good plan. So, I'm going to use my wings of flying and get wings, and then I'm going to, again, use my phasing leather armor as a bonus action. And raise and, up? Yep, 5, 10, 15... It I'm, so, I'm, I'm going to go right here. The very middle 5, up. 10, 15, 20 over here. They're going to the middle. Okay, I'm going to go to the middle, and then I'm going to fly so, up as high, high as I can. You better uh, give this motherfucker the people's elbow. I got you. As high as it'll let me fly in the arena. Alright. And we'll see what happens now. Sounds good. Okay. So, phasing does not provoke, is that correct? No, it doesn't. Meow. It's just like instant teleport away. Alright. Let me see what I shall do. Oh, fucking Baja Blast. God damn. Maybe I should have just bought it. Baja Blast. Let's see how much damage it did. Oh, shit. The best one was the Halo 3 game fuel. I love the game fuel. All the way up. Just give me one second. Let's I'm do some calculations. What I'm gonna do. Oh, wait, he's a monk, isn't he? Yeah. Oh, he could probably do some flying uppercut kick. <laughs> yeah, well, you're dead anyway. This is a bad idea. I mean, I could have rolled an 80 on Blight and that might have killed him. <laughs> oh, well, yeah, that's true. Oh, well, too late now. This is my best effort, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, my, my movement space is severely limited. <laughs> Ollie's, got his, Ollie's got him down to his relentless endurance. I got him down to zero hit points. He did. He was a one hit point when he fucking beat me. Got it. Right. And then you could, oh, I rolled 100. So, I need to make some rolls here. It'll never start. happen again. Nope. Nope. Damn it. Ooh. Good. It's alright, man. He thinks you're a big pussy anyway. Bullshit. He respects the shit out of me. No, he doesn't. He just saw you fucking can't even hold your liquor. Alright. <laughs> 40 feet out. He's passed out immediately. He Drinking my sorrows away, man. He's going. He understands. He's a fighter. To run. Yeah, a winning fighter, he's him. Doubled. Bitch. Talk to me that way again. You're, you can't, I, <laughs> you're not even making sense right now. <laughs> Talking to the man wrong. Stab you in the face with the old swag. <laughs> <laughs> Bring it on. 
Bring it on, Amsh. <laughs> Bitch, don't fuck with me. All right, guys. Let's go to the fuck each other. You ain't no thought. You guys are watching it. I think Amsh, Amsh is probably still unconscious at the at the bar table, <laughs> um, which is fine. I want to be awake. <laughs> Why don't I drink that drink? <laughs> and Stakes for me. But, like, you guys see him, uh, like, take a moment to study himself. He, uh, t like, because his, his hands are wrapped. Because he's a, a, a fighter, and, and he uh, he kind of presses his hands together and like, like like rubs it. Oh God! And you can see, of course, you're kind of closer, so like you would see this. But like his uh, when when he pulls his hands apart, there's like a gooey, sticky grossness that's there. <laughs> Right. Just my oh my god. <laughs> and so he's going to run with his well Oh genius <laughs> with his hands and like climb up the wall. He's gonna use a key point to use the step of the wind and he's going to uh, leap Oh god <laughs> We're just like <gasps> Oh no <laughs> Blames the bitch. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to leap. <laughs> and yeah, I, I was basing my monk skills uh, off Belaina. You know, what the fuck? <laughs> his uh, his jump, which, which is doubled with the step of the wind, and I rolled a natural sixteen for his acrobatics. Nice. Uh, with bonuses, he's going to be able to make it over there. Uh, Did he hit me? <laughs> he's going to make it to you, and we're going to do some grappling here. Uh, so, I need you, give me a strength saving throw. He actually might be good at that. It's plus three. Oh, no. <laughs> All right. That's a five. <laughs> so, he's gonna, like, jump out. He's gonna grab you. And that's pretty much how he has to end the turn. Okay. Is because he's he's just kind of grabbed on. He has his uh, his sticky hands mm -hmm. have kind of wrapped around you, and he's he he's actually like grabbing the wings. Mm -hmm. He's not doing. So he's not with holding that. me. He's just holding the wings. Yeah. But he is he's securely like attached to you. Uh, How is he attached to me if he's just holding my wings though? Well, that's what I do. Well, that. What if I make the wings disappear? Then you both fall forty feet. Do I get a turn to the ground? Do yeah, I get a turn? turn. turn. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Don't. I mean, you can do that. I'm, I'm not like, saying you can't do. Try to like hit him off of you. <laughs> so, is it my, so By his hands. <laughs> I'm going to so. use my action to actually cast fly on myself so I can fly without the wings. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to rescind my wings of flying so he just falls he, he falls forty feet while so I can hands take. go. Because like he hasn't grabbed, so like when Okay, well then I'm not gonna do well <laughs> then you'll be like, Oh okay, I'll scroll yeah, yeah. Kick like, him in he the has dick. super fast reaction time. Kick him in the balls. That monk. Was it a bad idea? If I teleport away again, will he teleport with me? Uh, that's an interesting question. Well, I'd say if I phase away, I can do one more phase. Only if the spell says you would. Yeah. Like, if you're using, like, Dimension Phasing? Door or something. Yes, but if you're... I want to phase. Well, actually, Dimension Door, he has to be willing to go with me. Uh, he would be. He doesn't want to fall for you. Yeah. <laughs> I'll come with you. <laughs> uh, let me check on that phase thing, bro. Uh, well, this is called phasing. What is that yeah. spell called? I want to be on it's the boat. Studded leather of phasing three times a day can phase up to 20 feet as a bonus action. You gave it to me. I know. I don't remember what. Uh, <laughs> that it's a pretty cool spell. I like it. Yeah. Why is that yellow? Because it's honey. It's crown royal honey. Anyway, we'll say. That's why. That the phasing Let me see the bag, that would be. I mean, it's just yellow, but I just want to see it. It's a big old dice bag. Um, <laughs> just you. Okay. Well, would be phasing. I'm gonna phase. Hey, how much of that have you drank today? 
Okay. <laughs> Do you see? Okay. Well then. This is nice. I've never seen this. I'm gonna face 20 feet over that way. So he would just fall 40 feet. I shoot him with blight. Hit him with blight. Finish. I will roll, and he will not do particularly well on that. Man, he made a weird noise when he hit the ground. <laughs> Danger. Oh. Yeah. Yikes. All right. That means we're out of time for this video. Uh, let's see. Sock falls. Got it. Uh, we'll be right back.